My name is Rahul Gonzalez and I run a design firm based in Bangalore called Pixelog. Um, I'm currently consulting with uh, C42 Engineering, which is an engineering firm which works on Ruby on Rails here in Bangalore. I'm Akash, uh, I'm founder of uh, C42 Engineering. It's a two year old uh, Ruby on Rails consultancy based out of Bangalore. Uh, Around like six months back, we started our first product, uh, RubyMonk, which was an online Ruby learning platform. Uh, unfortunately, we had uh, Rahul working with us for the as a designer because otherwise we had no idea how to go about designing. For two years, we are working with uh, close to 20 startups. Uh, and we being a pure engineering company, it was very difficult for us to do the designing. So almost all the time, we were working with other design agencies. Whenever a client wants a particular product design, uh, he would first talk to the design companies, get at least one or two iterations, or like, sorry, uh, to complete a product design, throw those design over the walls to us, and we do the complete development. We being an agile company, we generally like to work in one week iteration where we do development, release the product, get the feedback from the market, or from the investors, or from our, our other friends, and based on that, change the design uh, maybe change features altogether, change the layout, whatever is required. Uh, again, work for one more week and then release the product. Now, as the designers weren't working with us, whatever feedback we could gather out of development uh, development process, we could not give it back to the design. And that has always been our pain point. Rubymon being a real, like, Rubymon started with uh, just two months of funding. We had money, we wanted to do something, we really liked this idea. With just two months to release the product, get the feedback and do the iteration, we were actually looking at an iteration of two to three days, not even a week. And because of that, it was very, very critical for us to work very closely with the designer. And that's an experience where after a lot of mistakes and certain correct things, uh, good things that we did, we, got, we have gathered a lot of experience and now we are using that with our other clients as well. And that's the experience we actually want to talk about, I want to share over with you. Um, I think one of the important things from a designer is also that you can learn things from engineers. They're not as yeah, they're not as terrible as we think they are. So um, it's very it's been very interesting to see how design can fit into an agile framework. There are lots of things that one can um, learn and in fact improve one's designs through that. Earlier there was often a feeling that one should keep clients at an arm's length because they don't know what they're talking about, but especially designers and uh, developers. But there's actually a great benefit, especially when talking about web products, to actually working very, very closely with a development firm.